guys, it is me, Val Sims. Welcome back to my channel for the Sims 3 Heart Household. If you are new here and haven't seen my channel before, hello, welcome back. I have currently have three Let's Plays on my channel. I have the Sims 3 Generation, the Sims 3 Lepacy base game, and the Sims 3 Into the Future, which that one has been currently on hold because um, I haven't been posting that much a, a lot, but it will be coming back, don't worry. Um, I also have two current households on my channel, which is the Sims 3 uh, Lonergan, which is a Lepacy current household. And then I have the Sims 3 Heart household, which is kind of like a, le a legacy, but it's more like generations kind of thing. It's like both, but yeah. So with further ado, let's get on with the video. So the, like I said, this is the Heart household. I am updating you guys finally on the Heart household after a couple of months. Basically, if you have not seen the last part of the Heart Household, it was generation number four. Um, and yeah, this one is generation number five. Um, I recommend you go checking out the last couple of videos from generation one and generation four, and maybe this one once this is posted. But basically, that is representing like the first generation all the way to the fifth generation. Um, and their life so yeah so like i said this is the fifth generation the fifth generation is very far along um i have been playing this family non-stop and um basically we're having a lot of sims moving out and moving in and moving you know basically moving out and aging up but i'm going to show you guys this family before i move on to the sixth generation so this is the house this house is from the Sims 3 resource, I download all of my houses from the Sims 3 resource. So if you want this house, it is from the Sims 3 resource. Let me just say that, okay? So this is the front of the house. We have a lot of trees. Um, and then we have our car, which this is a 1988 Jeep Wrangler. If you guys know me, I love my Jeep Wranglers. Um, this is a girl, Berto. You guys know him from the last generation. And then in here is our truck. I think it's just the base game car truck. Um, this is Rona. I'm not going to say her name though, but this is Rona. You guys know who she is. You guys don't know who she is, but you know the name, okay? This is Rona. I had a name already because she looked a lot like it. And um, yeah. So let's just make our way into the front of the house. This is the front of the house. And you may be thinking, wait, the front of the house is like with the pool? I personally think it is, but either way, it's fine. But this is the front of the house. We have our little hot tub, and then we have our little pool, and then we have our little seating area, like our little ugh, a little um, grill, and then we have our like um, serving table. So let's go ahead and make our way into the house. Hold up. Okay. Um. So this is the house. So when you first walk in into my little front area of the house, we have the um, dining table and the kitchen. Yes, that's what you walk into, for my opinion. Um, and then over here is the living room. Um, and then over here is the office. And then over here is the outdoors. And then over here is the bathroom the downstairs bathroom nothing too too special and then i'm just gonna go through this wall right here real quickly because why the hell not it's gonna take me forever to get over to the other side anyway so this is the patio this is the outdoor patio or the outdoor area we have a trampoline we have a slip and slide we have a little doggo house even though we don't have a dog but that's okay then we have our little grave memory stones um which you all know they are I'll get into that in a minute. Then we have the pond, which is frozen over right now because of winter, but it should be not getting frozen over in the next couple of days. So let's go and head up these stairs. So when you first head up the stairs, you just see another set of stairs, but we'll get into that in a minute here. And then over here is used to be our snake terrarium, but he recently passed away yesterday. Um, which was sad, but that's okay. Over here, we have um, the first child's room, which if you guys don't know who she is, this is Miss Aid's room. Um, 
this is what she looks like or what she did look like when she was a teenager but this is her i freaking love her room it is so pink and just so her um she recently got into the base girl um which she forgot when she moved out but that's all right oh god that oh god okay hi but that's all right um and then in here is just her patio um and then over here is her bathroom nothing too too special and then let's go ahead and head over to this room over here in this room right here we have the boys room or was the boys room i should say our first um our first boy sim and then our second boy boy um our second boy and then this is a picture of our second boy, which I freaking love him. Oh my god, I freaking love him. He was such a fucking rebel. And when I mean a rebel, a rebel, okay? Like a full on rebel. Um, I don't have a I don't have a picture of the first boy, but that's okay. And then in here is their bathroom. We're just gonna head through their bathroom and head outside to their patio, which I didn't really see that it connected to the master bedroom, which we're just gonna go through. Um this is the master bedroom we have a lot of workout equipment we have the pull-up um thing and then we have the workout bench and then we have the treadmill and then in here is just the bathroom and um yeah so that is the um second floor let's head over up to the third floor so this is the third floor um there are only three rooms so in this room right here we have the twins room um the girl twins room um i love this room so much it's so cute we did have a bird but it also died yesterday oops my bad and then in here we have the pat their pat little patio we over here we have the ballet th um bar and then we have the um painting um easel and then over here uh i don't know why it's to hold up there we go and then in here is the upstairs bathroom and then in here is our adopted son um and this is his room and then this is his little patio thing so that is the house um very quaint um and uh, nice and fresh but let me go ahead and show you guys to our sims i'm gonna start off with miss eleonora because she is the mom of the house and you guys will recognize her more than you recognize everyone else so this is oh god hello this is eleonora she is um the mother of elizabeth and um or the daughter of elizabeth i should say sorry the daughter of elizabeth um and eleonora she is a loner she's flirty she's family oriented loves the cold and lucky she's 86 88 yeah 88 days till an elder her favorite color is purple her favorite food is crepes and her favorite music is country and she's a virgo her lifetime wish is to be surrounded by family reach sorry raise five children from baby to teenagers which we completed from six out of five um and then she is in the acrobat career yes acrobat i wanted to do her like modeling and everything at first but then i'm like i feel like she would be more of an acrobat because she just looked like one and so she's in the acrobat career she is a um level 10 master acrobat and her name is nora with the twist and she hasn't really got any gigs um we haven't really done much of them we've done a couple but not too too much she is athletic mastered level four charisma or technically level five because it's like right on that point um level six cooking and level one logic um and yeah that's her and she's thriving right now she's just currently also she has mastered the bodybuilder of the um challenges she's trying to get the marathon runner right now but that's gonna take her a little bit and then over here this is her husband this is theodore hart he is such a little cutie i freaking love him um but you guys probably don't really recognize him because he wasn't really 
At the time, Eleonora wasn't really dating him. She was kind of like secretly dating him, but in a way. But basically, Eleonora hooked up with uh, Theodore's brother. Um, and um, yeah. But Theodore is family oriented, a vehicle enthusiast, a smoozer, athletic, and lucky. He has 80 days into an elder as well. His favorite color is Irish green, his favorite food is hamburgers, and his favorite music is country, and he is as Taurus. He is, his lifetime wishes to become a superstar athlete, reach level 9 in the athletic career, which he completed. Um, and then he is level 9 in the um, athletic career. Um, he is a superstar. He is so close to level 10, and his skills are athletic master, level 1 in cooking, and level 1 in social networking. And then he has the marathon runner, and he is so freaking close to the um, fitness nut, I think. So we're working on that right now. So that's him. Um, and then let me go ahead and show you guys the family tree real quickly so that I can kind of do it by rundown, um, like family wise so right here this is um at this is um adeline adeline um is easily impressed a smooch neat a virtuoso and excitable um and she is in the, the music career and then this is her husband spencer they met in high school um he is family oriented eco-friendly a genius over emotional and unlucky and he's in the environmental uh career um, and then these are her, their chil two children, um, Elmer, no, not Elmer, oh my god, um, Lamar and Misty, th the game generated their names, I'm not too a fan of Lamar, um, but Misty's alright, but this is them, and then her father is Roman, um, he is avant-garde, hopeless romantic, handy, rebellious, and a great kisser, and basically, um, Eleonora had, um, Adeline when she was a teenager so she is um you know almost getting to the adulthood of her life but this is her um and then over here this is the first child of um Theodore and Eleonora this is Kettler Kettler is grumpy a dog person evil unflirty easily impre and easily impressed and apparently he's dating a girl named Marlene a guy named Marlone, Marlone, I think that's how I say it, and he is a decoy. And then we have Iker, who is my absolute favorite. I freaking love him. Oh my god, he is. I freaking love him. But Iker, he is a he is grumpy, mean spirited, a daredevil, insane and brave, and oh my god, he is all those things. He was such a daredevil. Um in his teen years and i freaking love him and he is in the firefighter career and to me saying why is he in the firefighter career like why i have no clue i just sat i'm like he wanted he wanted to be it and i was like oh my god i s totally see him being this and i'm just like all right i'm putting him in this career and i put him in the career and we're thriving with it okay but that is um iker they're both moved all three of them are moved out as you can probably see um, and then, yeah, over here, this is, um, Olivia, the third child, but she is a twin. So this is, Al this is Olivia. Olivia is over-emotional, photographer eye, perfectionist, loves the cold, and artistic. Her favorite color is pink, her favorite food is egg rolls, and her favorite music is Latin, and she's a Taurus. Her lifetime wish is to be a lifestyle of the rich and famous, reach uh, celebrity star level five, and be worth one thousand simoleons. Um, her career, she's unemployed right now. She's trying to figure out what she wants to do. I have the social um, circle, the event planner, the law, which I kind of kind of see her being the law, so I might have her do that instead. The modeling and the architectural career. So I actually want her to. Okay, I don't know. I'm gonna have her see what I want her to do, but I see her all three of the all four of those. I don't know, we'll see. But she is um sculpting level one, charismatic level one, guitar level one, painting level five, and photography level nine. And the reason why her photography is like really high more than everything else is because I've been doing the tabcast. 
but also I want to have her get that up before she moves out so that I can take a picture of um Eleonora before she dies so And then over here, this is her twin sister. This is um, Fern, and obviously they're fraternal because they don't look nothing. They look nothing alike, but that's totally all right. But this is Fern. She's so pretty. I freaking love her. She is a technophobe. She's disciplined. She's athletic. She's easily impressed, and she's an angler. She is twenty six days into a adult, a young adult. Um, obviously they're the same age. They recently just aged up yesterday. Her favorite color is orange, her favorite food is French toast, and her favorite music is country, and she is a Taurus, not a Leo. Technically a Leo, and she's a Taurus. I don't know. She was born She was born first, so I don't know. Um, she Her lifetime wish is to become a astronaut. Um, basically, dogfight your way to the top of the pack of become an astronaut in the military career. Um... Her lifetime wish is unemployed, her, sorry, she's unemployed because she's recently going to go get that right now. Um, she is athletic level 7, level 2 in painting, and level 2 in dancing. And, um, yeah. And then over here, this is Elmer. Hold on, let me go ahead and, um. This is Elmer. He is a freaking cutie. I freaking love him. This is our adopted son, Elmer. He is brave, he is handy, he loves the heat, and he's athletic. He is two days into a, um, almost to a teen, almost to an adult, young adult. His favorite color is hot pink, but I really didn't follow that rule. I mostly followed the color, I kind of made him, his favorite color red. His favorite food is fruit buffet, and his favorite music is a songwriter. And he is a Scorpio. He is, um, in high school, he's a grade B. Um, he is athletic level four, level two in charisma, and level five and logic and yeah and then over here we have our little kitten kitty cat so this is rosie she's non-destructive skittish neat proud and friendly and she's 40 days into an elder she has no skills and then over here is our other cat um percy percy is friendly and lazy he is 14 days into an el almost to an elder and then we have our um second born cat um neat uh, mrs gilbert gilbert is neat and friendly and then we have another cat which i'm pretty sure i'm not sure if it got adopted yet but this is twink he is our other cat but we got him up for adoption because um it was too much for me to take care of four cats in um a very large family so yeah so that is the family um and the house um and yeah but we're gonna go ahead and play um and um yeah i'm actually gonna go ahead and follow olivia and she's taking rona i love that the law career i kind of see her being that and i don't know why but i already am doing the law career with um my sim in um, Lonergan. Oh, she makes 24 an hour. Well, same thing, whatever. Um, Alright, perfect. And I can always change it when she moves towns, but for right now, I can kind of see her being that. So, I feel like Kitten Springs needs a law, like, sorry, um, a lawyer in their time. So, we're going to have her do that, and I'm going to have her head on home and yeah wait what did he make the bladder flow didn't he remake that i'm pretty sure he did already but apparently not he made the bladder okay he made the bladder the liquid horror the moon enhancer okay hold on i need a little Go ahead and discover another potion, and then I'm gonna go ahead and. Excuse me. Actually, this is what I'm gonna do. Okay. 
I need the rainbow. Even though orange might not come after a while, but. There we go. I think that's wrong, but do I really care? No. He's at level what? Level five, so. How many, how close is he? I have a little bit more. Alright, go shower. And then I'm gonna have you go ahead and head upstairs. And I'm just gonna have you shower in here. Shower. Uh, use the bathroom. And then come upstairs. Actually, no. And then I'm gonna have you listen to your Tabcast. Listen to Tabcast. Listen to the photography skill and then go ahead and paint a medium painting you oh she got some trophies we have our little <laughs> i'm gonna put that in there because i don't really care about that one debate whatever her i don't think she has anything what's this painting that she did I think and this is hers okay and then when you're done I'm gonna have you um work on I think I'm gonna have you work up on your thing go and exercise don't break a sweat all right you can go and stop and then I'm gonna have you serve up some food. Actually, I'm not. I'm gonna have you read. Um, go ahead and, oh, you already read that, didn't you? Read that. And then just feed her. Okay, well, she's feeding on me there then. Alright, let's. Yay! Which is this one right here and we're gonna see the bodybuilder which is about 60 hours so i think he can do it so that's strength so i'm just gonna have him come over here but i'm not gonna have him do that right now though because i'm just gonna have him watch some tv we invited to a party um i'm gonna say no because i don't want to all right and then she's about to Food. We're almost done. Yeah. Serve up some. Serve up food. Serve up some. Spaghetti. Um, I just want this one. I don't know if anyone's a vegetarian, but I'm just going to do. Mr. Elmer Duen to be good. I'm gonna go home and go take a shower. <sighs> Olivia completed a painting. Go ahead and sell that. What does she have for a painting? Level well, five. Okay. Alright, tomorrow I think I'm gonna go ahead and take the picture of um, Eleonora, but I am going to go ahead and I'm going to end. Hold on, hold up. I 
am going to go ahead and I'm going to end this current household here. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in my very next video. And yeah, bye!